What are some of the best things about non-league football and grassroots football? Uh, you, you, you meet some really, some really good players which could play a high level. Obviously, last season we played against St Neots for AC Hayes and they were a, uh, a very, very good side. And they had a big budget down there and they had people like Stefan Moore playing for them, who's absolutely what a great player. And he basically, uh, he, he was too good for this level really. They've gone up now. But uh, we beat them 1-0 and that was a nice feeling, obviously beating them. Because they, they they were such a good side and beating them was a great feeling. What does this competition mean to you? Oh, the FA Cup's massive, isn't it? It's, it's, it's biggest biggest uh, cup in England. I remember the days when Tottenham. I'm a Tottenham fan, and we had the uh, Lineker and Gascoigne, and Gascoigne scored that free kick against David Seaman, which was uh, 91. Great, great days, great times, and obviously you know, obviously we're never going to get that far, but it's obviously nice to see that at the old Wembley, and uh, you know, it's um, hopefully hopefully one day we uh, we could get a bit further. What would the dream be? What would the sort of the glory be? Obviously, you've got a, a taste today. What's it like playing in front of the live cameras? It's, it's unbelievable. It's a great feeling, well, especially scoring three goals today. It was a uh, great feeling. Uh, this, like I say, it's the first time I've ever scored three goals at this level. So it was uh, it was a nice nice one today. But yeah, it'd be nice to um, obviously get through the next round, beat Burkhamps did, and then you never know after that who you meet. You could meet you know a team in a lower league again and get through again. And it'd be nice to get to the first round proper, really. But we've got a long way to go yet. A long way to go yet. I drive fuel tankers for a living, that's my job. Um, you know, you work early mornings, you get up at half five uh, you know, to start your going into London and doing your driving around London and getting back out. And sometimes you feel tired and you have to go to train, obviously, because if you don't train, you won't play. So you have to make it priority to train um, so you can get out here on a Saturday and show what you can do. Yeah, the best thing about football is obviously getting away from your day-to-day -day life. You know, you work all day and it's like you come out here, you play and it just takes your mind off it and you just let out a lot of tension. And when you score goals, like for me, scoring goals is the best feeling in football. For centre backs, making a challenge is the best. But obviously, you know, it's nice coming here tonight, getting free and getting a nice big bottle of Budweiser to say that with me. It's a, it's a big achievement.